News 5 is investigating a dramatic prisoner escape. It spanned four states and featured one crucial stop right here in Cleveland. The prisoner stole a rental car from Hopkins, raced it more than 100 miles to Pennsylvania. And News 5's Megan Hickey has been digging into how he did it in his live near the airport. Megan, this guy did all of this while handcuffed. It's hard to believe. Cleveland police tell me the prisoner was handcuffed with chain restraints around his waist, and he still managed to make an escape. 34-year-old Wesley Massey is no stranger to law enforcement near his home in Crawford County, Pennsylvania. I'm told by not only this district attorney but other agencies that he's known for uh, being a con man. An accused con man wanted on three warrants and he fled to Florida where he was arrested. After several months, a private transport company was sent to Flagler County to pick him up. Massey and his escort took a flight to Chicago, then made another connection to Cleveland, where Massey asked to use the restroom at this Hopkins rental car facility. The escort said he left Massey unattended for two minutes and he escaped out the door just feet from the men's room entrance and right into the lot filled with unlocked cars and their keys. Then Massey managed to steal one of these cars, exit the lot and drive out onto the highway, all while still handcuffed. It was an unusual call to be on the lookout. He's wearing a white shirt, brown shoes, hand pants and he is handcuffed. Handcuffed while driving at speeds of over 100 miles per hour at one point. Massey made it into Pennsylvania where state troopers made one unsuccessful attempt to stop him. He was finally captured in Albion, Pennsylvania where police used spike strips. And amazingly, no one was injured. Now, Massey can now add fleeing police to his long list of charges in several counties. A spokesperson for Hopkins said there is no surveillance video of the escape. Live in Cleveland, Megan Hickey, News 5.